One, two, three, four. Ian, 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 Cowbell, Ian, 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 Cowbell, Cowbell. Yeah! Greetings, VR Corner fans. Welcome to this week's episode of Ian's VR Corner, where I'm going to be rocking Hotel R and R. Oh, jeez. Crikey. It's like EGX all over again. Uh, hello, everyone. Yes, this is Hotel r and a game which is coming out on PSVR this week. Uh, I've never played it before, but it has been out on um, PC in early access for quite a while. And it's basically, from what I can gather, it is a rock and roll hotel smashing simulator. All right, well, it looks like uh, I'm dead. Looks like I got electrocuted, and um, I'm off to Step heaven. To the light. Take me, no. Jeebus. Oh. I had you there, didn't I? What? It's just a pretty sweet echo effect on my voice. Okay. Now, get into the elevator. I have something better for you. Okay, this doesn't sound like Jeebus anymore. This sounds like the other one. So you might be able to tell that I am playing this sat like down at the moment. You you can't go waving that thing around we using dual move controllers. Look, Donnie, just stick to the script and leave the liberal halfwits to me. And yes, I am in hell. It doesn't look too bad, actually. It's got a sweet shot. Waste of a bloody toupee. Just oh, stay no. so sweet. All right. Okay. Crikey. Ah, yes. Hello. Pleased to meet you. Hello. If Pleased you didn't you. guess, I'm the devil. All I need from you is a digital signature on here, and you'll be taken backstage to start your career. Simple. Please, sign here. So, basically, Viewingtons, uh, the premise Even of this game tech, seems to be... It's not possible to read all shh, the T's and C's, so just shh, get on with it. Shh. Seems to be that I'm selling my soul to the devil in order for fame and fortune, and all he wants in return is for me to spash up some hotel Come rooms. On. It's not like you have a choice. That's we a, have a, it's not a hard choice to make. I love smashing no, the shit out of things. Just looking over the fine print, as stated in clause 221B. Yes. I oh, oh. Uh, okay, that wasn't too painful. Uh, he may have taken my soul, but he's given me back my body. And yeah, my uh, my arms look very sausagey. Ooh, I could smear some mustard on them and wrap them in a bap and. Oh, best hot dogs ever. So it looks like the first hotel I have to smash up is Crossroad Hotel in backcountry New Mexico. There's nothing more punk rock than a budget motel in the middle of the desert. So my rider is a foam finger. And that's all I can afford at the moment because I have zero cash and zero infamy. Let's see if I can do something about that. Well, here I am. My first ever hotel room as a successful rock and roll musician. There's not much to do here, I expect, apart from smash things up and maybe uh, admire my uh, gorgeous physique in front of the mirror. Cool. Pow! Poof! Ksha! Poof! Pow! Cool. Look at the muscles pop! Yeah! Huh. Uh. Uh. Yeah! Uh. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh! I don't know what happened to my elbow there. Ow! I'm going to have to get the doctors to pop that back into place. So here's my rider. Uh, the only thing I've got with my rider is a... Uh, a foam finger, which I guess I hold on to. I can't, I don't seem to be able to put my, oh no, I put my hand inside it by grabbing it. Oh, who's number one? I'm number one. And yeah, graphically, it seems pretty nice. You know, it's not too detailed. Everything's pretty basic, but it fits in with the cartoony style of the game. There is an incredible sausage here. That is, can I, oh, 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 oh. oh my word. I've only ever seen that in movies before. Uh, yeah, um, it's it's nice. It seems all right. The arena's not massive. This is my very first hotel room. Um, so I guess there's not much to do apart from get smashing. That works. Wait. Uh. Okay, yeah, smashing some stuff up. Can I throw the TV out the window? Oh, you can, ow, you can pick up the TV. Oh, it's a bad throat. Come on. Oh, I need to crouch, I think. Let's crouch. There we go. 
Oh, I made. Oh, oh the TV's a lock it. I've locked it. I've locked it. Listen up. This is useful on boarding stuff to get you on board, I guess. Oh, okay, yes. A member of the staff is on their way to your room. You do not want them to fully open the door or that is game over. Yes. Game over if they unlock the door, huh? Okay, well. Uh... No! 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 No, lady! I hope that I'll your okay, I. I think I committed oh, assault just there. Just a heads up. You can leave any time when the hotel staff What's that? Is that my safe? Oh, I guess there's a way to unlock a safe as well. Four, five, six isn't the answer. I guess I better keep smashing things. Oh, the this toast has come completely apart. Who needs vases? Not me. Yeah, rock and roll. Yeah, cactus. What's with the cactus thing? What's going on? Oh, well, there might be a member of staff coming again. I can't touch any of these. Okay. Bottles. Hello? Get fucked, man. I'm rock and roll. I can't turn that off. I can throw the bin, though. Yeah. All the things. What's in the fridge? Milk. I hate milk. It's full of vitamins. There we go. The only vitamins we need are in vitamin beer. What? Ow! Oh, nuts. Got shot in the face. Well, I did just throw some bottles of booze. I did earn $29, though, but... Uh, I lost a lot of money on lawyers' fees and resurrection fees. Oh, dear. All right, well, uh, let's try that again. Okay, so basically I need to make sure that people do not break in. That is locked. Okay, so all these are locked at the moment. What I did was I uh, i think I might have unlocked them earlier, which is not a good idea. And that... Oh, sh okay, that's the bathroom. Okay, we didn't need... I didn't know there was a bathroom in here. Didn't need that door. What's in here? A, a trash chute, huh? Okay, uh, got some deodorant. Let's, let's just throw all the bits in the bathroom in the trash and turn the sink on. Uh, throw that in there. I've ripped that off, the hot flush thing. Can I fill, is there any toilet roll? What I'd like to do is fill the sink up with toilet roll, like block the sink up with toilet roll, and then hopefully um, we'll end up with a, uh, a flooded bathroom. Flowers! Oh! <laughs> I see what they did there. Coming in. No! You better be uh, don't come in, lady! And close. Okay, that's all locked again. Excellent. Alright, so we've just got to be careful of people sneaking in, I guess. Um, I don't See how much damage I can do with my sausage. Not much. <laughs> yeah, well, this is, I tell you what, if you're having a, a bad day, this thing is bound to be quite therapeutic. Uh, toaster. Come on, telly out the window. Oh, I keep hitting myself with the telly, I think. There's a kettle. Made some money there. Big money, big prizes. I'm ready for the cop this time. Bottle him. Shall I bottle him or shall I Bible him? I don't know what's going to do the more, most damage. Technically, I'm a, I'm a slave of the beast now, so this holy Bible is probably going to do me damage, but. Give me a bottle. Not that. This one. I'm waiting for the cop to turn up. Okay, I think he's coming. Kicking ass and shooting the face. 
I don't know what happened there. Well, I, my work. well, I died again. Am I supposed to try and lock the door on him? I did make a lot more money that time. So there doesn't seem to be a way to stop the cop from uh, from shooting you in the face, like. So, oops. I, I guess I've got to try and lock the door before he tries to open it because he just kicks it. It's not like the maid where you can just kind of like lob something in her face and instantly she buggers off. It seems to me more like this guy, this cop, is uh, indestructible. Welcome to Crossroad Hotel. Can I change the channel at all? No. Oh, I've smashed a, a, have a kettle. Come on, right, pull it out. And... Well, it didn't go through the window completely, but it was pretty good. I'm not a douchebag. Yeah, me too. This is no messing around. That's just egg and tomatoes. This shit's out of this room. No! You s s eat my fruit! Oh, no, no. Okay, I don't have anything to hit her with, so I'm just going to have to... Bump! Bump! There we go. Stay down. Keep going. Oh yeah, security my ass. Come on. Smashing through that fridge. Here we go. Maybe I just need to be quicker with my destruction. It's just absolutely leather everything. Ah! I'm a golden god! I'm a golden god! I feel like I'm a bit drunk though. What else? This... 229... Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a... Okay. Come on, door, bathroom door. Yeah. Uh, uh, what's this do? Oop. 30 seconds. Is there a way to... Okay. Can I just... Okay, what I did there was I tried to escape before the cop came. Maybe maybe that's what you have to do. Maybe you just have to escape before the cop kills you. Uh, I made quite a bit of money there. Not bad. Uh, total 800. Oh yeah, that was much better. Okay. Bank 290 and check out exit via the hotel door. Alright. Alright. I think I'm getting it. Porn to die. Hello? Hey, this isn't the kind of pawn shop I was after. Where are the naked bottoms? Oh, <laughs> there's one. Can I... No? Oh, okay. I take it back. That's kind of pawn, I, I guess. Is what is... That's a pig's ass. I don't know what kind of ass that's supposed to be. Uh... Oh, that's a very gimpy mask. This is halfway to a pawn shop, to be fair. 13,500? 45,000? It's going to be a little while before I can smash up a hotel room with a gun. Is there anything I can afford with $500? I can afford a jock strap. Fine. Well, I don't think I'm going to be able to do much with that jock strap, so um, I guess it's time to head backstage. Okay, so I need to be more infamous in order to progress to a new hotel cause three hundred dollars of subtitle damage and escape before the maid tries to get in. Wait, what's that? Six eight two. I wonder if that's something to do with this maybe that's the safe code. Alright, what I need to try and do is damage enough stuff without damaging myself and seeing that red screen I think. Uh, but first I wanna see if six eight two what the six eight two. I wanna see if this is the code for the safe. Yes, looks like it. Hello, <laughs> hello my beauties. Here we go. This is more like it. Oh nice. Oh, we are gonna cause some ooh, real problems now. How do I, 
How do I shoot these guns, though? I have to hold... Wait, what? Huh. There we go. I was picking up with the wrong button. Come on. There we go. All right. Yeah! This is more like it. Woo! Oh my god, the whole wall's falling off. Okay. Let's try and escape before the maid comes. Okay, no hospital fees, no lawyer fees. $457. That's got to be a few. Yes. Okay, I've done enough. I've done enough um, infamy to uh, hopefully unlock a brand new hotel. Holding the guns is a little bit weird. Like grabbing the guns and then firing them feel a little bit weird. Um, not exactly the easiest thing to do, but um, I got an, I, I managed enough damage for me to be able to uh, proceed. Oh, this is oh, this is much nicer than the last hotel. It's spacious as well. This is really pretty. Oh, I could, I'd actually could quite enjoy staying in a place like this. A lovely resort. I there's got to, I've got to end up throwing a TV in the swimming pool, right? That's that's just. That's the law uh, of um, of hotels, right? Of 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 rock and roll stars in hotels. The bloody doors! Ugh. Ow! I just smashed myself in the face with the door. Where's my telly? This hotel even got a telly. Hold on, there's another door here. Is that just going to be the out cupboard? Uh, that's another safe. Um, all right, well, there doesn't seem to be a. A TV to throw into the swimming pool, but oh no, here it is. It was just uh, piled high atop all oh, this speaker stack. Huh. Oh god. Duh. Oh, it's heavy. It's pretty heavy. Okay. All right. I need to grab this with both. Oh. Uh, why can't I? Here we go. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Oh, grabbing's very wonky. Uh, in the swimming pool! Fuck. Oh well. I tried. What about, let's let's get some igliter into the swimming pool. Like, maybe this flamingo. Are you going to go, flamingo? Oh. Shit! Oh, fuck. Something's got to go in the swimming pool. Here we go. The chair in the swimming pool. Threw the balloon into the swimming pool. Hup. Balls! It went. Uh. Whee! Oh. Meh. Okay, shit. The maid's coming. Let's... GBH her in the face. I'm coming! Hello? I'm not stealing robes. I might have had a wee in the shower, though. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Basically, was incredibly evil to the staff there. Oh, it's okay, don't worry, though. I'll tip her later. Expensive champagne. Wow! Ah! 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 Off. And you. And you. You can go. Uh, 50 seconds. I need to smash some windows or something. Uh, uh, yeah. Flip a table. Can I flip a table in this? Whoa, I can flip my own table. Whoopsie. <laughs> ah. ah. Shit! It's me! Smashy McSmasherson! Here to smash your folds! 
Ah. Can't smash those mirrors. Ah. Let's escape quick. Don't chew me, cops. Ah. Oh, I'm bleeding. Oh, shit. No. Ah. Did hotel security go too far? Star dead. I certainly am dead. 93, sorry, dollars. Wow. Well, look, cause fire damage. Throw a TV and at least 10 other items into the pool and exit before the maid comes in. I've got to get better at picking things up. There's got to be a knack to picking things up that I'm not very good at yet. Move control, having the move controllers be your movement scheme, it's not the best thing, to be honest. Um, as we all know with first-person controlled games in PSVR. But, um, in general, uh, the tracking's fine. It's just the, uh, yeah, picking things up can get a little bit weird. Come on, you little fucker. Come here! I got you. Oh. I've, I've, I've jammed it. It's stuck on a... You little fur... Why can't I pick it up? Come back here. I'm going to get you. Huh. Huh. I, got, I got part of it. I got, there we go. Oh, you little shit. Oh, fuck. Ow! How do I do fire damage? How can I set something on f fire? I wonder... What if I... Is there like um? Ooh, is there any metal cutlery or something? Maybe I could put the toaster in there. See, picking up the toaster's fine. Fuck. Really, whoops. Hey, Doesn't really I'm fit. Gonna go deal with that What's what's something Shut metal off. that I can put in the? Uh... Oh dear. Here we go. This is metal. This will go in the microwave. See if I can turn the microwave off and start a, a fire in the microwave. Fuck! It's... <laughs> what? Sometimes it goes... Gr Sometimes things go... Gr Ow! Okay, well, it worked. Whatever I was trying to do, it worked, but it was a little bit weird. No! No, no, no! Whoops. <laughs> Oh my god. She's gonna be after a pay rise. Come on, the toilet lid off. No. Oh, come off. There we go. Just, I like, you could you do quite a bit of damage just by punching stuff, I think. Uh, 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 yeah, that'll, that'll do it. How do I set things on fire? Fuck. Uh, Speaker stacks over. There we go. Nice. Not exactly the biggest explosion I've ever seen, but I can't smash that. Screw windows. Ah. Screw your flowers. Whoops. I keep hitting so much stuff in my room. No. I'll just walk through the glass. All right. Escape. Oh, no. Is it? Why can't I? What's up? Shit. Oh, damn it. I died again. I do feel like maybe there's a knack to this game I haven't got yet. Um, Some of the, like, the controls feel really inconsistent with what you can do. Sometimes you can open the door before the guy comes. Sometimes you can't. Uh, I mean, maybe it was just because he was just about to open the door that I couldn't open the door. Maybe you have to do it within a certain amount of time. I don't know. And some things you seem to pick up really easily. And other things, sometimes you can pick them up easy. Other times your arm vibrates. I don't know. It's it, it helps fit in with the silliness of the game. But also it's a little bit frustrating when you think you can do something. And then... You, you, or you, you, you think you can do something, and you're trying to do something, but it's just not working out. All right, 
It's getting incredibly hot and sweaty in this headset right now, so I'm going to have one more go at causing some destruction in this lovely hotel before I uh, I finally give up and give you my first impressions verdict of the game. I'm not really sure how the best way to go about starting my destruction is I could just explode a bottle of wine in my face, I guess. Let's start off by... Is that all the brown M&Ms, wasn't it? Uh, let's start off by trying to blow up the microwave. Just very gently close that and then... There we go. That's, that's better. That's how you do it. So... I've successfully microwaved and I'm standing back. Oh. Well, that didn't explode. Oh, yeah, it did. Jesus, okay. That did some good damage. That did some excellent damage. So, uh, what else can I use? It's, like, it looks like maybe props would be a good thing to use. Uh, kindness. Oh, yeah, I'm smashing the bits of the table here. That's good. That's good. I gotta smash a little bit before the. Oh, is this the. Hold on, there's a big flat screen TV here. Can't tear that off the wall, but I better stop the maid from coming. Sounds like she's on her way. Let's just knock all these down. No! I'm gonna boop you in the eyes again. Come on for it then. Boop! That's how you do it. That's how you do it, my friends. Okay, let's smash that. I don't know what that does, but can I pull it down or just kind of moves a bit? Let's. Oh, look at this. These glasses here. Cocktails. Can I flip it? Ooh, ooh, I can. It's coming. So, the, definitely, the some of the things are quite strong, and perhaps you need a bit of extra time or some tools to knock them over or smash them. Can I smash the telly? The flat screen telly? No. Oh shit! Is the, I thought the cop was coming. Okay. What's in the toilet? Can I break the toilet? Let's put them in there. Uh, smash that. Smash them. Smash that. Let's leg it. Let's get out of here. Whew! Did not die. Oh, look, the safe code's up. 828. Eight. Hmm. Okay, so I did lie about that last one being my last go, but if I can get some firepower from this safe. 828. Eight. That'd be pretty cool. Give me. Give me a good gun. Come on. What the hell? These aren't guns. They're firecrackers. Okay. How do I light them? How can I... How do I light the cherry bombs? Maybe I can put a cherry bomb in the microwave. What would that do? Oh, a cherry bomb in the toaster. That's not... It's not turning on, is it? Shit! Damn it! Let's try another one. No. Don't come in. Fuck. No. And stir. Wait. Oh, no. Cigarette doesn't do nothing. Thought maybe I could use a cigarette to... Oh, uh, looks like the microwave blew up anyway. Um... Yes, I have no idea what you use to ignite the cherry bombs unless it's something you have to buy from your rider later on in the game. I presume this is just a game where you, re you just keep repeating, playing as much as you can, earn as much money each time in order to visit the pawn shop to buy different kinds of weapons and tools which will aid you in your future um, destruction, hotel room destruction derby. but. Uh, at the moment, yeah, all I've got is uh, that little pointy finger. And it doesn't seem to be helping me too much in my cause for chaos. All right, let's go. 
All right, my friends, that is as much Hotel r and on the PSVR that I'm going to show you today. I enjoyed it. I definitely enjoyed it, but um, it felt, controls-wise, it just felt a little bit janky. Picking things up never felt 100% satisfying. Sometimes it does, and other times you'll try and pick something up and it'll just... Like bounce out of your hands a little bit and I don't know whether it's meant to have this kind of wonkiness of the control scheme uh, for like a quop like aesthetic but I just when I heard about this game I imagined just being able to pick up a baseball bat and run around and smash things absolutely trash things and it seems like it's going to be a little bit harder than that to do it seems like you're going to need to work at it before you can get the cool weapons to actually do some proper cool destruction like you're gonna have to you know you're gonna have to chip away at the hotels first before you can come back with a big bang a big gun and just smash all the walls down and stuff uh but you know i had yeah it was a lot of fun it's quite funny definitely perhaps one to check out with the party mode that's included where you can like pass the helmet and stuff it does get a bit a bit hot and sweaty in this helmet though so do bear that in mind if you're thinking about sharing a PSVR helmet with your mates. You may be um, sharing some bodily fluids as well as uh, video game funsies. Uh, and that's definitely not a good thing to do in the current situation. But anyway, yeah, this game is coming out in uh, about three or four days after this video has been published um, on our channel. Uh, this game will be available on the PSVR, of course. It's already available on early access on the PC. So if you've got a PC, do check it out. Talking about checking things out, why not check out these other Ian's VR Corner videos what are on screen now. They are full of vr -y goodness and they'll keep you entertained for uh, a fair few hours because there's a lot of them now. Anyway, talking about keeping you entertained, it's time I played you out. One, two, three, four. Ian, 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 Ian.